Hello YouTube, my name is Jackson. Today I'm back with another video. Um, today I'm finally back in front of the camera. The past two weeks I kind of did stuff behind the camera. But today I'm back in front of the camera and I'm going to show you all three champion hoodies that I picked up over this past fall winter season. Now I know fall and winter is a long time ago basically. Uh, and for some of you it's pretty hot where you are but for me it's still kind of chilly for every like one warm day there's like four or five cold days that follow so if i wanted to i could still wear these but anyways like i said i'm gonna show you all three champion hoodies um one i picked uh i'm sorry one was a gift the second one i picked up with a gift card and then the third one i bought myself um the reason i picked up two more after the one i got as a gift because i just love them so much I to try them out and my girlfriend got me the first one for Christmas and then I bought two more after that. So like I said, I do love these. I think they're essential for everybody. Um, I think it just kind of adds like a staple piece, like that go-to hoodie. If these are just go-tos, um, even to wear plain, I love them. So there's three reasons why I think you all should buy these champion hoodies. The first one is they're super trendy and popular right now. So a lot of people are wearing them. You can kind of say it's on the downhill slope, but a lot of people were wearing them, even like celebrities. I know I saw Scott Disk in one, I saw uh, Tyga was in one, and a bunch of other celebrities have been wearing them lately. What I do is that they're a great, great, great price point. So they go anywhere from like 50 to 60 bucks. And um, to me, that is like that is like a super, super steal. It's really like this. Um, I've been looking for hoodies just to toss on like whenever I want to and just kind of chill in or have something simple but also kind of stylish and trendy and get them in even more colors for the upcoming fall and winter uh, months. 60 bucks, you really can't beat it and um, you can get them anywhere. You can get them at your local um, Urban Outfitters, your local Paxon, or even Champion.com. I think they're called the Reverse Weave Hoodies. So the reason I think you all should get, get yourself a hoodie, um, uh, a gym hoodie to be specific is because they just look good and they're sleek. They're super plain. Um, they come in a bunch of colors, like I said, and all they have is the champion C or the champion script on um, your chest, and that's it. They do have the champion stamp down here, which I'll show off. They fit great. They don't feel like a gilded hoodie. They don't feel like you know a Hanes hoodie. The sleeves are tapered a little bit, so from your um, from your wrist to like your elbow, they're actually a lot slimmer than you would expect. Um, first one I'm gonna show you off is this tan or like beige one. Um, I guess it's more so tan, but this is the first one I got, and my girlfriend actually got it for me for Christmas. Um, so I told her that I kind of wanted to try champion hoodies out, champion hoodies out, and she bought me this. I believe she said she got it from Urban Outfitters online. So um, check your Urban Outfitters. Um, I think this colorway is is long gone, but still check it out. This just has your C with a little red hit in the middle. Wait, I have some stuff on it. But yeah, the champion stamp right here. Here is the first one, and this is probably my favorite one. It actually goes with my Yeezy 350 V2s uh, copper, but this is probably my favorite just because I love the color. It goes with a lot of my kicks and a lot of my uh, jeans. And, okay, the next one is the maroon one, and this is actually the one I got second. Now, this is a little different. This has a champion script, so it has, this, it has a little smaller C, and then it has a script. It spells out champion. This also has a little red hit in the middle. Um, I got this one from Paxson with a gift card I got from Christmas. Here it is Champion Stamp. Um, now in my local Paxson, they have like all the spring spring champion stuff and not so much hoodies. And this stuff is like a little more louder, a little more stand out. So I don't know if they have hoodies still. They might still from the fall. But go check out your local Paxson. If not, check it out online. But this is where I got mine from. And um, this is the second one. And I'm going to show you all the last one. This is the third and final one that I picked up. Now this kind of has a kind of a small, small story to it. To it, um, I saw it in store a few times and I wanted it, so I finally pulled the trigger on it. And to me, and I don't know, I'm not sure what it looks like on the camera, but to me, in a person, I thought it was a charcoal hoodie, and it was perfect. You know, I wanted something darker compared to to those two first hoodies. So I thought it was charcoal. I got home, and the first time I wore it, I wore some black jeans with it, and the contrast you could tell was from from my jeans to the hoodie. The hoodie was definitely not charcoal. It was it's like a dark, dark olive green because uh, the green pops out more than you think in certain um, circumstances. But this, like I said, this has the champion script as like the second one does with a little red hit in the middle. Then you have the champion stamp down here. So this is the third and final one. Just super plain um, hoodies, and that's really why I like them, and they're super comfortable as well.
So I want to talk about sizing. So I like all of my shirts and all of my hoodies and tops to fit a little bit oversized. So um, I'm typically like a large, but for these hoodies, I didn't. I knew they weren't oversized hoodies, so I wanted to get oversized. So I actually sized up. I'll show you what they look like on body here in a minute. But um, I suggest if you kind of are into the boxy oversized fit, get a size up. If you want a more traditional hoodie fit, get your get your standard size. And also, uh, is it all three hoodies? And I'm sure this goes for all champion hoodies. They have the waistband at the bottom. Now, some of you. Um, I think like those some of you, so some people don't. I don't like waistbands at the bottom, so I don't like when they can const, um, constrict my waist and you can't lay yourself underneath it. That's another reason that size up is because I want to make sure that waistband wasn't constricting. And it's actually not if it's perfect. I can throw a shirt underneath it, kind of layer with it, have the bottom shirt sticking out just a little bit, and it looks great. So actually, just to hit on where you can get these at. First off, I would check you you all's local backs on. I know. Mine, like I said, has most of the spring champion collection, but go check it, see if they have any um, old, old stock from the fall and winter of the hoodies. Um, and then also, secondly, I would check PacSun online. Secondly, I would check Urban Outfitters. Um, I don't think I don't think they have any, but still check it. Um, I'll leave my links in the description. I know Urban Outfitters, as, as far as I know, kind of like introduced the whole rebirth of this champion stuff this past so check your local Urban Outfitters um, and UrbanOutfitters.com. And then lastly, I would just go to Champion.com. So go to Champion.com and search um, Reverse Weave Hoodie. That's what all of these, I guess you could say, new stylish hoodies are. They're called Reverse Weave Hoodies. If you want to go to a place that for sure has them, go to Champion.com. Just make sure you buy the right style, and that is uh, Reverse Weave. So that is it, guys. I appreciate it. Thank you very much for stopping by. Um... Let me know what you think about this type of video. Do you like these hoodies? Do you own any? Um, if you own some, let me know how you like them. If you don't, um, let me know if you plan on copping them. I would highly suggest it. I'm going to leave a few links down below so you can check a few places out where to get them at. Make sure to leave a like if you like this video. Um, and make sure to subscribe for more content. Peace out. See you next week.